Hi, I'm Kelsey Brennan Wessels, and you are watching Earth from Space on the European Space Agency Web TV. This image of Romania, with the political border in red, is actually a mosaic of 13 scans by Sentinel 1A's radar acquired in October. The scans were acquired in dual polarization, horizontal and vertical radar pulses, from which the artificial color composite was generated. What looks like a backwards L shape in this image are the Carpathian Mountains, sweeping down from the north and across the center of the country. Romania is home to the largest area of virgin forests in Europe, most of them in the Carpathians. These forests are home to brown bears, wolves, and other animals, and many thermal and mineral springs can be found in the foothills. The longest river in the EU, the Danube, flows along part of western Romania's border with Serbia, as well as its southern border with Bulgaria. The river then flows northward and empties into the Black Sea via the Danube Delta, which lies within Romania and Ukraine, visible on the right side of the image. Designated a UNESCO World Natural Heritage Site in 1991, the Danube Delta is a labyrinth of river channels, lakes, bays, floodplains, marsh and reed beds. This vast triangular delta is home to an extremely rich variety of birds, fish, animals and plants. Romania's capital Bucharest is visible in the southern part of the country as a cluster of bright radar reflections, expanding outward from the center. Bucharest is also the site of next year's land training course, to be held in September. ESA organizes the course each year, devoted to train the next generation of Earth observation scientists in the exploitation of satellite data for science and applications development. And that brings us to the end of this edition of Earth from Space. Remember that we broadcast online every Friday at 10 o'clock Central European Time. Watch us on our website or through the ESA app on your mobile device. From the ESA Web TV Studios, I'm Kelsey Brennan-Wessels.